I'm here with Tim Allison, the Oxnard Federation of Teachers Executive Director. Tim, thank you very much for joining us. Thanks, I appreciate being here. Now, you've been a delegate before in, uh, for Obama back in 2008. Now you're a delegate for in California this year. Um, can you talk about the similarities you're seeing between uh, this DNC and the last one? Yeah, I was fortunate enough to get elected uh, to kind of the two exciting uh, uh, opportunities for a, a Democratic convention in our lifetime. And that was 2008, Barack Obama's uh, uh, convention in Denver, and then here in Chicago. You know, the, the Harris campaign is only about a month old, but what we're seeing right now is incredible enthusiasm. We're seeing shades of the excitement that we saw for the Obama campaign in 2008. And you come from a family of uh, union uh, members. Can you talk a bit about uh, what Harris will do for the unions, uh, and particularly the teachers union? Yeah, you know, my mom was a special ed teacher and my dad was a, a plumber, steam fitter and pipe fitter. And so they come from a blue collar background, union friendly backgrounds. And, you know, right now what we're seeing in this country is one political party that understand and gets it that that politics has to work for the working class that people need a hand up not necessarily a hand out just a hand up they need an opportunity they need uh, this a belief that they can they can do anything they need a strong public education and the democratic party gets that and is enacting policies that help individuals in the working class unfortunately on the republican side of the aisle it's not happening there there was one individual that spoke at the Republican convention and the delegates basically booed him for talking about the support of, of labor and the support of workers' rights. Sean O'Brien, the Teamsters Union leader? Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, very different perspective here. Here, the working class is welcome. Here, the middle class. You'll hear Kamala Harris in her speech on Thursday night and she's gonna talk about how we need to make this country work for the working people of this country. Tim Allison, thank you so much. Thank you, I appreciate it.